Hi and welcome to another video by Couches Campers. Today we're looking at a new 2011 Crossroad Zinger 30RL 5th wheel. Take a few minutes and walk you around the outside and then the inside of this coach. One of the first things you'll notice on the newest model of the Zinger is the champagne front end. We also have a lower diamond plate on the front section here. We have power front jacks. This Zinger is optional fiberglass exterior. One of the things you'll notice on the front is our three inch gutter extensions, trying to keep the coach as clean as possible. You'll also notice on the Zinger roof line, they have a nice three inch rollover of the rubber roof. A lot of brands butt that gutter rail right up against the top. Zinger actually rolls it down, give it a smoother look and also extra water protection. We have deep tent safety glass windows. We have a nice size awning on this coach. We have outdoor speakers. We have a nice storage area in here. We have our little lights and stuff in here as well. You'll also notice plywood flooring, aluminum floor deck here in the bathroom area. Zinger has a triple entry step. There's also a light at the entry step as well. We have our large folding entry handle. We have our porch light. We have outdoor electric outlets, six gallon gas electric water heater, and we have our stove exhaust as well. You'll also notice on the Zinger campers the secure stance wide track axle system allowing the coach to travel down the road smoother, less sway issues. One of the best things about a Zinger product is they have a two-year manufacturer warranty. Most RVs in the industry only have a one-year warranty. This coach has a carrying capacity of 3,914 pounds. You'll also notice the 30-inch wide radius top entry door. They radius the entry door so that if it ever brushes against the awning, it's not going to tear a hole in it. Some models still use the cheaper square top door. We have a propane hook up in the back here where you can hook a grill or something to the rear of the coach if you'd like. And then we have our heavy duty scissor jacks on the rear. You'll notice a nice champagne rear end as well. Our spare tire and mount. Nice crowned radius rooftop for water runoff. We have our fresh water and city water hookups on the rear of this coach. Four inch square tube bumper. A lot of people like to store their dump hose here. You'll also notice that we have our cable hookups here as well too. Now down below, one of the things you'll notice on the Zinger product is a nice enclosed underbelly. This helps extend the camping season. Also helps to protect the bottom of it from debris and rocks flying up and hitting tanks or anything. We have a dump station right here. This is for the galley tank of the uh, kitchen sink area. We have an electric rack and pinion slide out. This is an electric motor that has a manual crank override in case of failure. It can be manually cranked in. Here we have our power cord pull out, 30 amp power service. We have our furnace exhaust, our refrigerator maintenance access panel. And just down below, we have our gray and black water dump tank. We have our outside shower. And behind this door here, you have a battery box area. Now we'll take a couple of minutes and walk you through the inside of the coach. Here we have our 
hitch light and our power button for the front landing gear. You'll notice also on the Zinger they do have screen doors. Walking inside the coach you have a fire extinguisher at the start. We have nice E-stone countertops. We have a ground fault electric breaker here. We have our porch light and interior light switch and our slide out button. Our monitor panel for all our holding tanks and our battery condition. We have our water heater on electric, water heater on gas, and our water pump button. All right next to the entry area. We have our high rise faucet, our nice 60-40 sink area. One of the new features on the newer models of the Zinger is also the ball bearing drawer guides. Also you'll notice on the Zinger models they have little locks on them as well. you will be a real surprise how many dealers or RV manufacturers leave locks off on the drawers. We have a 16 inch oven by Atwood. Three burner stove top. Has the range cover. A lot of dealers leave that off. Also has a little knife rack behind here. We have our range hood and light as well. High point microwave. And back here in the living room area, you can put up to a 32 inch flat screen TV back here. We have a Jensen AM FM CD stereo system with indoor outdoor speakers. You'll also notice this coach has the upgraded nightshades instead of the less expensive metal mini blinds. We have a couple reading lights underneath the cabinets as well. Really nice swivel rocker chairs. Nice overhead cabinets in the slide out. A few upgraded lights in the slide out as well too. Nice e-stone countertops on the dinette here. Also another nice feature we add to our zingers is the nice deep drawers in the dinettes. Great for pots and pans and dishes. There's one under each dinette seat. Loads of cabinetry and pantry area. We have our Dometic six cubic foot gas electric refrigerator freezer. furnace is located directly below the refrigerator behind here and this is an in-floor ducted furnace and we have our electric box with our breakers and fuses in it and beside that we have our propane leak detector This model has a nice enclosed bathroom area, nice little hallway, actual doors going into the bathroom and bedroom area. We've got our smoke detector and our TV antenna crank handle here. Hallway light switch, controls for our Dometic furnace and air conditioner. We have a crank up roof vent with fan. We also have a skylight above the shower, glassed in neo angle shower, foot flush toilet, nice real wood medicine cabinet, nice sink with height, good height. Also have a door into the bedroom area from the bathroom or from the hallway. You'll also notice too on the Zinger, their bathroom actually has doors that lock. 
be real surprised how many brands don't put locks on their bathroom doors. Nice size bedroom. Hanging closets on each side. Overhead cabinets. Roof vent. We have air conditioning and heat in here as well too. Also have a bed that raises up so there's extra storage underneath of that. We have electric outlets on each side of the bed. We have a light switch for when you walk in here. You can flip on the lights. And our carbon monoxide detector right here in the bedroom. Also you'll notice the nice crown molding look along the top of the zinger inside. A lot of brands use a cheap rubber gimp molding. Saves them a few dollars, but kind of takes away from the look and the quality of the coach. We have a place to mount an LCD TV here with TV hookups up here as well. Again, this has been another Zinger video by Couches Campers. If you'd like, visit us at our website, www.couchescampers.com. It's www.couchs.com. Thank you for your time.